hello, hello, everybody. Hi, Scoots. Hold on, I'm messing with my audio. Hi, hi, it's nice to see you. I hope you're having a lovely Thursday evening. Hold on. I broke my mic stand, so I'm trying to like fix it. I need a new one, but you know. Oh, I hope everybody's having a lovely evening. Okay, I'm gonna switch to my lo-fi because I can't have all the thingies in my ears. There we go. Okay. Y'all, I can't believe August is already almost over. Like, it's the last day? What is this? <laughs> um, so, September... I think the discounts are already live, but that's going on. Um, in my Discord, also if you guys want to join Discord, it is available. Um, all of my revenue that I make in September, um, half of it is going to a charity. I haven't picked which charity yet, but I think it's going to be mental health related. I'm thinking to write love on her arms or project semicolon um, because September is, or se not September, September is, um, I believe it's Suicide Awareness Month and that's mental health stuff is something I'm very passionate about. Um, so uh, yeah, half my revenue I make on Twitch in September is going to ch that one of those charities. I'm not, I'm not sure yet. I'm going to... Do a little research, look into it in a, a little more. Um, so that's going on. Uh, September's a little confusing this year. I think one month and three month, you get 25% off. And then six month in advance, you get 30% off. And I think that's everybody, not just new subs. And then discounts on gifted subs are the last five days um, of the month, I think. It starts like the 26th. So I feel like they did a little better with September this year because last year it was like no gifted subs whatsoever. So I, I kind of like that they added that in at the end of the month. That's That, that was a really, actually really nice of them. So um, honestly, I renew a lot of my subs in September just because of that <laughs> reason for the discounts, but the streamers should get the full payout from what I understood. So that is going on. Um, Scoots, how was your week? I hope you had a good week so far. I've had a very rough one. I think some of you may know already. Um, also, my Discord bot like won't post that I'm live and I don't know why. Watch, I'll paste it and then it's gonna do it. Okay, sorry. What was I talking about? Oh, my rough week. Yeah, like, so I found out that my school job that I had last, this past uh, year, they didn't stop my checks. And I asked around and I was like, hey, is this part of my contract? I genuinely thought it was like the payout finish from my contract. And turns out it wasn't my checks were supposed to stop and they want me to pay back 5k and I'm like if I hadn't said anything y'all would still be paying me checks um they're like we're not gonna make it do all up front and we're gonna see if we can work out a deal because apparently the superintendent left our public schools in a huge mess like she resigned in June and the lady who did payroll was like super sick and had to leave and there was some other things going on and so like I guess I just fell through the cracks because they accepted my resignation and it was noted like in board meetings and I got that certified letter and all this kind of stuff so they it's bad enough they had to outsource this stuff to a different CPA company <laughs> so it's like super messed up. I'm like, I can't give y'all more than a hundred dollars a month. I'm like, I'll, I, I'm sorry. I genuinely didn't know that 
it wasn't part of my contract. So yeah, that that was a, a big blow to all the things. Sorry, I was turning my speakers down. I, I did a bloop bloop. Oh, goodness. Okay, so... I don't like this song. I'm switching it. My ADHD. Um, so tonight, I think I'm, I have two games that I can't decide what I want to play. I've got Sea of Stars that just came out. And then I started a Baldur's Gate run, a Baldur's Gate 3. Um, I'm in Act 1 in Baldur's Gate 3. I don't even know where I'm at, what I'm doing. I'm just kind of running around looking at stuff. So, um, it's between those two games and Sea of Stars looks phenomenal and I really want to play it, but I also really want to play Baldur's K3. <laughs> and then Starfield is out, but I don't want to pay a hundred dollars to have early access. So that'll have to wait till next week. <laughs> but then I also want to play Overwatch and I'm like, I have problems. I don't know. I was going to wait till a few more people get here and see kind of what mood we're in. But I appreciate you guys lurking and hanging out and stopping by. I always enjoy your company. Do, 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 do. Let's see. I don't know. Maybe we'll do Sea of Stars because it's new. And I think everybody's seen a lot of Baldur's Gate. Although a lot of the interactions in Baldur's Gate are super funny though. So, um, let's see. Also, what was I going to say? Oh, most of you know her. My girl Ashy has do, is doing some cookie orders. You guys should, um, okay. My brain's not working go check her out I think she's got two orders available this week um that's her twitch page and you guys her cookies are amazing like I really want some <laughs> but I gotta save my money but I want cookies let's see I tried let's see it was the strawberry cheesecake s'mores uh taco dip cookie the regular ones and then confetti which is it was kind of like confetti birthday cake oh my god they were all so good you guys um i think my favorite was probably the confetti birthday cake because it was like cakey and it was really good and then there was something else i was gonna say um Oh, I'm going to try to stream more in September for the charity stuff since I'm going to do the half of my revenue to um, charity. So I'm going to try and stream on Monday nights and Thursday nights unless I just don't feel very good. And I'll let you guys know in the Discord. Oh, yeah. I probably should post on Twitter that I am live. You know, my brain. I need to borrow someone's brain cells. Um, trying out Sea of Stars. I took a nap before stream and I'm just like all over the place. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Has anyone else tried out Sea of Stars yet? Also, is my little rice ball working? Okay, it is lighting up. Good deal. Um, <laughs> that, that gif is cute. I hope...
I don't know what I was gonna say, y'all. There's Twitter if you would like to repost for me. I would appreciate it. Do 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 Okay. Close that out. Um Let's see. Okay, I'm going to pull up Sea of Stars. And we shall get into the game. Pause my music. Get off of just chatting. Sea of Stars. Done. Um, I haven't opened this or set it up yet, so bear with me. Plug my controller in. Hi, Dark Angel. Welcome. How are you? We're getting the game set up. Gaming. Um, hopefully Game Capture picks it up. Oh, come on, Microsoft. Don't be poopy. Dark Angel, I hope you're having a good evening. Also, I apologize in advance if the game is like super loud. Like I said, I haven't set it up yet. <laughs> okay. I'm doing all right. I'm a lot better today than I have been this week. So it's been really good. Okay, let me press the button. I've got my controller plugged in. Oh. I'm going to have to turn it down. Options. Um. Oh, okay. Um, that was really loud. It scared me. UI. Okay, the dialogue bloops are kind of cute. Music. There, I think I want it down one more. Okay. Brightness full screen. I don't think I want that on. What does pixel perfect do? Does anybody know? Also, I think I've got to adjust my screen. It looks too big. There we go. Um, I don't know what pixel perfect does. I've never seen that before. It was off, so I'll just leave it off. Vibration. I don't want vibration on. Gamepad. Okay. New game. Okay, this is Sea of Stars. I don't know anything about the story, but the pixel graphics are super cute. Sea of Stars has two main characters. Select the one who will lead the party. This can be changed later and does not affect the story. Cool. So it looks like we got Valerie. I'm pretty sure that's how you would say it. And then we have Zale. A blade dancer born on the summer solstice walks the path of the guardian god Solon. Cool. A monk born on the winter solstice walks the path of the guardian goddess Luana. Okay, listen, I just want to be a girl, okay? Okay. I just realized that this is probably going to be a lot of reading. <laughs> oh, no. Welcome to the Great Archives Adventure. I suppose curiosity brought you here. Yep, it's going to be a lot of reading. Oh, well, it looks really cute so far. I love it. An important trait to be sure. I am the archivist and immortal versed in the ways of alchemy. Cool, teach me. But perhaps you knew that already. No, I didn't, but let's go. After spending millennia cataloging the many events of countless timelines, I decided to return here to mull over everything I had seen. In my musings about the stories that fill these books and scrolls, I had a recent epiphany. It seems that in my haste, I may have overlooked the very thing I was hoping to find. Oh, what is it? As such, there is one special story I wish to revisit, one deserving of a witness. Oh, we're going to be a witness. 
And should the mists of time allow a slight alteration, I believe the ray of hope that was once offered may yet bloom. Okay. I like how he keeps, he or she keeps looking back at us. <laughs> so walk with me tonight and we will explore a tale of high adventure. Cool. Of magic and deceit, of friendship and wonder, but mostly a tale of heroism. One that I believe will offer valuable insight in the search for a resolution to the throes of the Fleshmancer. Ooh, the Fleshmancer. That's a nice name. Throws. Now, I remain a bit lost amidst all these timelines and all their subtle variations, but I know just the one to make for a perfect starting point. The dude in the chair reminds me, like, of Sheik from Ocarina of Time. Just the, the mummy wrappings. Let us see what we find in there. Okay. Also, can you guys hear the game okay? I kind of turn things down I didn't mean to not that there's a whole lot to hear at the moment but I'll turn it up a little bit okay I think that's good okay that all looks good all right uh yes our story begins in a world visited by the fleshmancer generations prior causing much turmoil and leaving a mark that has yet to be fully cleansed Somewhere on Evermist Island, two brave children of the Solstice are on their way to meet with an immortal spirit. That would be us. In order to become fully-fledged Solstice warriors, uh, they will need to learn how to use magic without using magic. Huh? We gotta figure out how to use magic without using magic. My chair squeaks. I wish I had a new chair. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. I love the pixel graphics. Alright, we made it to the mountain trail. So far, so good. So the elder mist lives somewhere here, huh? Do you think it's just another test? Could be, but it beats sitting at the academy and sewing. Ha, yeah, I'm sure glad that's over with. Apply yourselves, for the will you weave into it shall be your sole defense in times of greatest need. <laughs> While the lessons taught here may appear to be lost on you, something deep inside is compelled to learn. <laughs> that's funny. They're cute. Hey, the sun will be setting soon. We should prepare to set up camp. Let's split up and search for a good spot. Okay. What if I wanted to go that way? Time for some scouting. Oh, it's a goblin. I'm coming through. Oh, well, we're going straight into it. Oh, we don't have any skills yet. Okay. He's vulnerable. The sound is a little low. Okay, just a second. Um, is that a little better? The music. I like the music. Oh, I killed him. Yay. How do you say that? Br Brigaves? I wasn't kidding. These feel easier to fight already. Who's Brigaves? Let's see where this leads. Okay. Perfect. Awesome. Okay, that feels good. The engraving is worn out, but it definitely mentions a rite of passage for children of the solstice. The Elder Mist. Oh, cool. Look at it, it looks so cute, I like it. Hi, Starshine, how are you? What the hell is that? Is that a, like a ram or a goat? Huh, can I pet it? Come here. I'm gonna pet you. Come back. I hope you're doing good, Star. He looks angry. Also, he makes like a weird. He sounds like a sick turkey. <laughs> I knew it. He was gonna come get me. I don't wanna hurt him. 
chilling. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate you guys. Ouch. Tough one, huh? Let's try this. Oh, I get a skill now. Crescent arc. Oh. I know all the new games are out, and I'm like, I don't know what I want to play. Valerie found anything? Oh, look, there's berries. I want to pick them. Just a dead end. How about you? Nothing of note, but the way to the top is definitely through here. Okay. The sun is setting. Come over. I'll get a fire going. I'll be right there. Can't wait for more tomato clubs. Press A to unroll rope ladders. Cool. Oh, that's nice. So far, it's like super smooth and looks really neat. I'm impressed. It makes me feel like I'm, you know, playing like the old like SNES type games, but I know it's going to sound weird, but with better graphics. I've been wanting to play this one for a while. I had seen it on... I think it might have been the, the Nintendo Indie Direct or whatever they do. Oh, uh, that was scary. I was looking at the slug. I about died. Oh, uh, attack. He looks angry too. Owie. Let's try Moonerang. Actually, I want to see Moonerang. I like the music. Oh, um. That was, that was kind of scary and difficult. Uh, I wonder what would have happened if I missed. I guess it would have hurt me. <laughs> Jump. Jump. Okay, this one's a little awkward. There we go. Oh no, there's another goat. That sounds like a sick turkey. Clap, clap. Thank you for the claps. Ha, huh, but it doesn't beat the face you made the first time you tried a smashing a sunball. Oh, I can still hear the headmaster gloating. As I said, whether by paying attention in class or by recklessly attempting to hit a projectile with your open palm, you will learn the first rule of solar magic. To be fair, you did learn. <laughs> oh yeah, that one only took once. You ever miss those years? Before training, just being kids, always daydreaming, getting in trouble? Yes. I miss being a kid. Zale, a lot. Merlin, hi! How are you doing? It's nice to see you. I hope you're all having a wonderful evening. This is the new game called uh, Sea of Stars. It's on Game Pass, by the way. So if you guys want to play it, you have Game Pass. Also, I have like five uh, free 14-day trials to Game Pass. If anybody wants a link to that, let me know. Um... I forgot what I was saying. Also, those of you just coming in, all the money that I make on Twitch in September, half of it is going to a mental health charity. So that is going on along with September. Okay. I'm sorry, Valerie. I didn't mean. It's okay. I understand why he wouldn't want to join us after what happened. It's just. Oh, I think I missed part of the story. I wish he had said goodbye, you know. After 10 years of not seeing his face, just to know that he's all right. Husband, I love you. What are you doing? After 10 years of not seeing his face, just to know that he's all right. And that we're still friends. Why did we have to get ahead of ourselves anyway? Oh, Garl. So, <laughs> all I can think of when I see Garl is like, Carl, Carl. I love you, husband. Ten years ago in the village of Moon Cradle. Thank you for the biddy. Mm. 
My weapon will be something that hits really hard. And I'll pick a fast one. We'll be unstoppable. Look, it's Carl. I love the Dino Dance emote. It's so cute. Imagine all the wonders we'll find after we leave Evermist Island. I want to see the sleeper. Carl, what? What's that? You've never heard of the sleeper? Stories say it's a giant serpent and it's been sleeping curled up around the mountain since even before there were traveling historians to record it. Yay, you're playing! Yeah, I was like, should I do Baldur's Gate 3 or should I do Sea of Stars? But oh my gosh, this is so cute. I'm glad I picked this. I didn't realize and think about that it was going to be lots of reading. So <laughs> that's going to be fun, but <laughs> no way! Sure is, and it's super dangerous too. But don't worry, it can't wake up. Oh yeah, girl, I don't know how to read. Can I borrow one of your brain cells? <laughs> Why not? Okay, do you think her name is pronounced Valer or Valerie? Because I really like Valerie more, but I could see it being like Valer. And I really just want to go girl every time I see his name. <laughs> Apparently there's holes in the mountain and the, wa the wind blows through them and that plays a melody that keeps it asleep. Whoa. I want to see it too. It's the bell. Erlina and Brugraves. Br uh, br br Brugraves. Brugraves. I got it. This is like rear wheel drive and like drawer and like hard words. Quick, maybe we can catch them before they go to the academy. Oh, we have like an actual party. Is this a save point? It is a save point. Yay! Oh my god, like all the nostalgic like pixel graphic feels. It's so cute! Do, do, do. What's in here? Is this where we go? Hey there, younglings. Are you still playing in that little cave down below? You got stuff? Can I take your stuff? Hi, Cake! How are you? It's so pretty. These crops are our main source of food. It's hard work, but I'm reminded every day when we eat all together that the effort is worth it. Oh, who lives here? I hope you're not getting into trouble again. Trouble me? No. You're okay? Good. How's your family? I hope you guys are good. Hey, wait. What are we waiting for? Oh, it has animated scenes. I love it. There you are. Playing in your secret hideout again? We were training. I think I can use magic now. Is that so? Let's see it then. <gasps> Mommy? Amber had a tummy bug, but it seems to be getting better, which is good. I'm glad she's getting better. I'm sorry you guys had the bug. It's been going around here, too. Whoa. Come closer, Zael. Open your palm and concentrate. Yes, set the child on fire. Perfect way to start a game. What about you, Valerie? Have you been training, too? Every day, I bet I'm stronger now than you. Haha, <laughs> I'm sure you are. Come here, then. <laughs> Why is this so wholesome and cute? I love it. Well, easy now. I can't report to the headmaster if you knock me out. Oh no! Look, she did set him on fire! <laughs> that was awesome, Zale! You did it! Oh, he set himself on fire. Correction. Solstice Warriors! I'm trying to do different voices, but I'm not really good at it, so... 
If you are done with your babysitting duties, I would hear your report. Rude. Right away, headmaster. Can we go too? Believe me, once you enter the Zenith Academy, you'll wish you hadn't. Let's go, Burgraves. His name is so hard for me to say. <laughs> hey, the full moon is out. No crap it is, isn't it? It's out in real life too. It's a super blue moon. He's right. Want to go to the Forbidden Cavern again? Why do I feel like this kid is nothing but trouble? We tried already. I can't open it. Yeah, but last time we decided maybe the full moon could make the rune more sensitive. I'm sure it'll work. And Moraine will be so impressed. He'll take you two in for training right away. And then we'll finally be allowed to leave this island. What if he gets mad and delays our training instead? Nah, no way. Well, we can worry about that after I open it. <laughs> I mean, if I open it. Alright, let's go. Okay, Coral. Moon Cradle. Is there like a map? Mm -hmm, I'm pushing all the buttons, sorry. Um, oh, this is a cute little place. Bedtime soon, okay? Bedtime, what's that? Okay. I guess that's like where we all sleep. I don't know where I'm going. I'm just kind of exploring. Who this? Celestial Willow is a gift from the Great Eagle. Always treat it with respect. Okay. Are we going this way? Okay. This is just an outlook. I really like the music in this game so far. We just jumped off of a cliff. I guess we're going this way. <laughs> oh, the world map is cute. Huh. I like it. Okay, we're gonna save. <laughs> I haven't been doing well saving in Baldur's Gate 3, so I keep having to go back and redo everything. And I'm like kicking myself every time. We made it. Time to stop for a snack. What? I'm not hungry. Yeah, we just left a few minutes ago. Look, it's not a real adventure if you don't eat a snack on the road. He's not wrong. Plus, I made something special for the occasion. Here. Dang, that sandwich looked good. Wow, that's really good. Yeah, no kidding. Glad you like it. It's the jam. I used a bit of sap from the Celestial Willow. You could get in trouble for that. Only if you tell. <laughs> I knew it. He's nothing but trouble. Alright, how do I do this? Maybe like Erlina showed me? Try opening your palm and concentrating. You got this, Valerie. Why do I feel like we're gonna get in big trouble? I knew it! It worked? I did it. I finally did it. So what now? The headmaster must have heard the bell ring. Do we just wait for him to show up? Might as well enter. It can be our first adventure. I don't like this kid. And then the headmaster will know we're not afraid. This is exciting. Let's go. Something bad's gonna happen. I want it. 
It's pretty, I like the crystals. Oh no, it's the slugs. Those things are kind of scary. There's monsters over there. Let's hide. I thought Evermist Island was safe. I guess that's only true for Moon Cradle. We should go back. They look dangerous. Yeah, good call. Oh, my mic fell over. Oh, oh no. Sorry, I'm fixing it. Watch out, there's another one. I'm gonna find something to stand up against it. Stay. This is bad, we're surrounded. Maybe try to use your powers? We're not ready for this. I, I don't know, just try. Okay, let me focus. Watch out, it's prepping something. Come on, come on! Valerie, watch out! Oh no! It hit him! Garl! Sorry, I couldn't resist. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna have to order a new mic stand. It keeps falling over. I'm sorry, chat. My eye! Hopefully this is not too loud. I'm trying to like get the mic to like chill out. Oh no, he lost his eye. That sucks. It really hurts. I I can't see. There's no escape. It's about to attack. That was cool. So it was you. As resourceful as you are reckless, I see. Headmaster Garl needs help. Looks like he just beat him with his cane. It feels better. Like anyone born in Moon Cradle, a regular kid, what Garl needs is not is to not concern himself with the affairs of the Solstice Warriors. I'm really sorry, Headmaster. It was all my idea. Hey. Be thankful that the only cost of this lesson was an eye, young lad. As for the two of you, if you are so eager to receive training, I shall oblige. Follow me. Oh, dang. Something bad's gonna happen. Make sure to treat their wound and soothe the poor kid. He's not the complaining type, but if the pain seems to return, please send for me. Understood, Headmaster. You will not see your friend for a very long time. If you have any parting words, speak them now. Dang! I... Can't he come and stay with us? How long is very long? Like a week? Ah, the eagerness of youth. It takes years to properly train Solstice Warriors. Years? No way. But your friends have much to learn. I would suggest you use that time to reflect upon what happened today. With any luck, it will help you forget any ideas of getting involved with the burden that is not yours to bear. God, he's mean. Guys, don't forget about me. Never. We'll train really hard. Maybe it won't take so long. Aww. Oh, that's cool. Is it Hogwarts? Guys, we're going to Hogwarts. I'm a Hufflepuff, by the way. <laughs> Welcome to Zenith Academy. In this ancient place of knowledge, you will learn everything you need to know in order to become true solstice warriors. 
We've been waiting for this for so long. When do we start? Tomorrow, though I believe a proper introduction is in order. Careful now. Wow, he's got lots of hidden elevators in this place. going we're up like really 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 high welcome to the classroom in the sky whoa it's beautiful I'm feeling a weird resonance like when I opened the forbidden cavern good on you for noticing that getting closer to the stars helps new recruits get acquainted with their innate magic it shows great promise that you were able to feel it before, and Zale too, from what Erlina told me. Oh, it was just a small burst. They have no idea how much potential they have. It is probably for the best. Now, in the many years you will spend at Zenith Academy, you will learn about the duties incumbent upon Solstice Warriors, or the of the magic you are destined to wield and the evils it is meant to cleanse. We'll learn how to fight too, right? Naturally. You will spend your days training and studying, but most importantly, sewing. What? Sewing? That sounds boring. Oh, I can assure you that it is. <laughs> A mandatory task nonetheless. All who would join our order begin by weaving their will into enchanted piece of fabric. The staple of the solstice warrior. Interesting. It is their most prized possession, guaranteeing light in the darkest places and a measure of protection against the minions of the Fleshmancer. But first, you must learn of your duties. Train until you cannot feel your limbs, and then train some more. Once both your body and mind are ripe with potential, you will create a magic piece of fabric worthy of the very stars. That sounds cool. I want one. You will then be sent out beyond the Forbidden Cavern to meet with the Elder Mist, for it alone may officially grant the title of Solstice Warrior. Sewing. I understand it is not what you are hoping for, but it is what is required of you for the time being. Years of sewing? That will be all for today. That would suck to find out. <laughs> oh no. You will be spending a lot of time in these halls, so you should make yourselves at home. To your left is the training room. You are to go there first thing in the morning. Just above is the way to my chambers. It is off limits, of course. And to your right are the dormitories. Just make sure you pick a bed aligned with your innate magic. Feel free to look around, then go to sleep when you are ready. Good night. Cool, let's go look around. The game looks so pretty. What does she have to say? Oh, there you are. Maureen finally decided that you were ready. <laughs> no, we just did bad things. All right, let's go. Can we go see his dormitories? Off limits means only if you get caught. <laughs> Who dat? I remember when Erlina and Burgraves were your age. They wouldn't stop running. Ugh, I feel old now. Oh, it's so big. Oh, look, a save point. Yay. There's all kinds of neat things over here. Oh, look, it's where we have to sew. Which bed do I want? I think I want the one in the corner. Go to sleep, yes.
the next morning in the training room. I'm scared for them. <laughs> Good morning, fellas. Brigades. So you'll be our trainer? I wish. Erlina and I are leaving tomorrow, but the headmaster was kind enough to let us make your first day special. Are you ready for the training? You bet. That's what I like to hear. I reckon these should be well suited for the two of you. He received a training sword. And she received the staff. Awesome. All right, let's get to work. Huff, huff. You got this, Valerie. Don't give up now. Never. Dang, look at her go. Wee, come on, Zale, keep up. I, I can do this. Ninety-nine, one hundred. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Starting tomorrow, I have to do like thirty-five squats a day because I signed up to do like a Saint Jude challenge to a thousand squats in September, and uh, I am fundraising for it but it's on Facebook and so it would give away like my name and information and so I like can't share it here but if you guys wanted to um, donate towards that I would send you um, like confirmation that I did it but you wouldn't be able to get like a deductible for it so that's going on my goal is 250 for that plus we have the mental health charity from my twitch revenue so we got a lot going on in September, um, but I hate that the only way that I can fundraise for the St. Jude thing, this specific thing, is on Facebook, because I really just, I'm like, but it shows my name and everything, and I don't want to just, like, put that out there, so, um, I don't know, but I'll keep you guys updated when I do my squats and stuff, so that's going on too, I forgot about that. Oh, and those of you that just came in, <laughs> I kind of just said it already, but half of my revenue that I get in uh, September is going toward a mental health charity. So I'm going to try to stream two times a week, Monday and Thursday nights. And then, um, I don't know. My brain's not working. No, no, I need your, I need your brain cells right now. <laughs> okay. That's it for today. You did great. Phew. That was a lot. Feel free to take a break. Arlena will see you on the terrace whenever you're ready. Doo, doo, doo. Out here, I guess? Yeah. Oh, there you are. Ready to learn magic? Her design reminds me of, like, Lulu from FF10. It should feel as if something was scratching an itch far away from you. You must focus on the sensation and compel it to come closer. I think it's working. Hey, you startled me. I almost had it. Now mine's gone, too. It's okay. Just breathe slowly. <laughs> Look, they're doing magic. Try to release only when you feel its current passing in front of you. Oh. If your timing is true, it will manifest. On three. One, two, three. I think I felt it. It tickles. <laughs> right there, you just did the hardest part. I'm sure your training will go well, but one more thing. No matter what the headmaster teaches you, remember that this is your life and Erlina. Oh, she's going to get in trouble. Since you are done onboarding our new recruits in the ways of magic, I would provide the briefing for your next assignment. As for the two of you, it is about time you tried that sewing kit. Oh no, we have to sew. Move along now. 
And making a magic piece of fabric worthy of the very stars sure is a tall order. Yeah, I have no idea what shape to even make it. <laughs> At least the headmaster said we wouldn't get it right the first time. Well, I'm bored. <laughs> what are you doing? I'll just walk around a bit. Can you check out things? The designs are so pretty in this game. The colors. You keep saying that, but the Fleshmancer left our realm for good when the Dweller of Strife was destroyed. So why can't they have a normal life? And you know, the three of us can take the one on Wraith Island. We don't need them. Prudence Erlina, there is no telling what threats we may face in the future. Valerie and Zeo were brought to Moon Cradle by the Great Eagle. It is not the place of the Headmaster to question such things, and neither is it yours. So how much is enough? What about Moyara? What about the twins? Brigades! Do not judge a sacrifice you cannot begin to comprehend. Crap. Ads start in like... 10 seconds. This conversation is over. They will study here while you carry on with your investigation. On the first eclipse after the training is complete, they will join us for the cleansing. Learn as much as you can until then. But. Okay. Let's just go, Burgraves. Okay, maybe it's at a place I can stop. And so they train and they sewed for days and then for months. Faster now! Snooze. Focus and then release. Okay, it won't let me snooze the ad. And the longer a dweller is left to its devices, the stronger it gets. Makes patrol duty essential. Let one grow for too long and you have a world eater on your hands. Oh, that sounds scary. Against such a foe, even a legion of solstice warriors would be helpless, since delaying only increases the chance of a world eater cleansing always target the strongest dweller known to us. Okay, I'm gonna let it sit here while the ads run. <sighs> I apologize for ads. It didn't give me the option to snooze this one. I hate it when it does that. So we're just going to chill for a minute while the ads go. You guys should stretch and hydrate. Oh, goodness. You know what? I forgot to take my medicine. While ads are running, I'm going to go uh, to the restroom. I'll be right back.
Okay, I am back. Oh no! A rave. I see it. Y'all are funny. <laughs> Did you say Star started it? That's hilarious. Merlin, I love you. Donut. Okay, I didn't play any of the game while the ad was running. I'm so sorry. Makoto Nijima says hi to you, Sassy. Hi, Spade. You snuck in there. I didn't see you. I hope you guys are having a wonderful evening. Thank you for hanging out with me. Oh, goodness. Okay, let's get back into the game. We are playing Sea of Stars. Um, let's see. Headmaster, if dwellers are immune to our magic, how can we fight them? Oh, no, I broke it. There it goes. Okay. Ah, that is why cleansings are always performed during a total eclipse. In these moments, only the dweller's weaknesses are exposed. How many dwellers are left? Just the one, known as the Dweller of Woe, but we cannot know for sure. The fleshmancer just may have planted other seeds of evil before leaving our world. Thus, we must always remain vigilant. Headmaster? Yes, Valerie? What happened with the Dweller of Strife, and who's Moyara? That will be all for today. Did you know Makoto is voiced by Sharami Lee? Uh, she does a lot of voices. A few weeks later, a sound in the night. Oh no. Valerie, wake up. Say, oh, what is it? I think I heard a voice coming from the entrance. What time is it? Who cares? Let's go check it out. You're excited for this weekend? What are you doing, Spade? You know what? We should probably save. Right now in the game, we're kind of in... Oh, the anime event. Nice. We're kind of in... Um... The prequel part of the story. They're young kids right now. Oh no, what's that? Hey, look! Oh, smells good. There's a note. Dear Valerie and Zale, if you're reading this, it probably means I got caught. I'm writing this as a failsafe, but I hope to see you in person. I made cookies filled with the celestial willow jam you liked. Oh, it's from Garl. Oh, keep reading. I'm doing everything I can to be ready to leave when you graduate. Got to check packing. Nice. In the meantime, I hope your training is going well. Oops, now the platform is almost up, and I can see Marine is there waiting for me. <laughs> He looks very angry. I will try to drop the jar without him noticing. I guess that means I won't be able to try to visit again. But I'm thinking of you every day and I can't wait. I hope you like the cookies. Your friend until the end of time. Garl. Aww. Garl's the best. Let's go up on the disc to eat the cookies. I got a cookie jar. All the cookies. Oh. These cookies are amazing. I can't believe Garl was just there. I miss him so much. He seems well, at least, after what happened in the Forbidden Cavern. Knowing him, I bet he smiled it away the next day. Haha, <laughs> you're probably right. We can't let something like this happen ever again. At this rate, it feels like we'll never sow something good enough for the Elder Mist. It will happen. We just have to keep on training hard. And so they trained and they sewed for years. And then they trained and they sewed some more. <laughs> Until one day. Look, they grew up. They're cute. Mm -hmm. 
Zale, that's the one. I can feel it too. Hold on. Alright, I think I got it too. Let's go see the headmaster. Oh, look, we're all grown up now and we got our special capes. We're gonna save again because I don't want to do all that story over. Headmaster, we think we're ready. Why, yes, the tingling of magic in the air has been building up for a few weeks now. Congratulations. Moving forward, there will be no more sewing. I can deal with that. It will soon be time for you to leave on your journey to meet the Elder Mist. But before we get to that, Zenith Academy has one more challenge for you. On our... Oh, our visitors just arrived. Perfect timing. My, you've both grown pretty strong. Hey, it's good to see you. Arlena and Burgraves are here to help you review the basics of combat. Check in with them, then it will be time for your final test. I'm scared. We're going to have to fight like some boss or something. Ready to go through the basics of magic? Yes. When enemies prepare spells, you must do everything you can to prevent them. If you follow your senses, you can try dealing damage of the types that will break their concentration. Simpler spells will only demand normal attacks. Valerie can do blunt damage and Zale has slicing. Let's see you break this one. Just like that. Now some spells will also demand magic damage to break. You can control your projectiles now. So let's give it a shot. Zale for sun and Valerie for moon. Or Valerie. I don't know. Uh, skills moonering. Oh yeah, this thing. Press A to deflect. That is really hard to do. Sunball. Hold A for power. Oh, cool. Well done. Now you can sense your MP is a bit low, right? To keep up the pace in battle, you must remember to regenerate MP. Let's build it back up a bit. Hit me with a normal attack now. Attack, attack. Did you feel that? You just got some MP back by attacking. That's nice. In battle, awareness leads to victory. You must pace your spells with normal attacks to avoid ending up in a dire situation with no MP available to get out of it. And on the flip side, you should not hesitate to use spells when MP abounds, for a regular attack on a full bar is a waste of regeneration. The key is to experiment. Keep on varying your actions and find the rhythm appropriate for each battle. One last thing. All battle actions lock, breaking especially, build your combo energy. When you have enough, you can spend combo points to perform powerful actions. Combos cost no MP and are lost after battle, so you should never hesitate to use them. Moraine told me you came up with your first combo attack. Show it to me. Cool. Yeah, you're strong, all right. Keep an eye out in your adventures. You're bound to come across scrolls that will teach you more combos. Cool. Good luck with the exam. I'm sure you'll do great. Want to review combat basics? Sure. Let's get started. Just attack me now in any order. Oh, I can psycho through characters. Party members can use their turn in the order of your choice. But they can only act twice per round. Excuse me. When all of your party members are on cooldown, the round resets and they become available again. Cool. Good. Focus is paramount when you perform attacks and skills. With proper timing, you can increase the damage that you deal and sometimes even score additional hits. Let's see it. Press A as the hit connects to increase damage. Oh. 
That was too soon. Stay focused. Okay, I'm sorry. Ugh. Ah, I see. Let's see that one more time. I'm trying, my bro. Oops, I missed that one too. I hate timing stuff. I'm not very good with it. Ouch, yeah, that's the gist of it. Most of your attacks and spells can be made more potent with proper timing. Some also keep going blah 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 blah. Okay. Ooh, blocks. Oh no. What is he? He's scary. Reduce the damage of any incoming attack by spell or blocking. Press A as the hit connects to reduce damage. Oh. That was too soon. No, it wasn't. It was perfect. Leave me alone. That was... No, it wasn't. Leave me alone. Uh, okay. I'm going to have fun with timing in this game. Oh, I missed again. I'm pushing it as he does it. Okay. Yeah, I'm probably not going to be blocking a whole lot because that's really hard to do. <laughs> Excuse me? He just knocked me out. You're back up on their own at 50% once all the KO stars are gone. The KO stars are low. You move. Oh, interesting. I don't want to fight and survive until he returns. Okay, I've got the attack down. I still haven't got the block timing yet. Marine will see you to the final test. I'm sure you'll do great. I'm scared. Are you ready for the final test then? Yeah, sure, why not? Then let us begin. Do we have to fight this old fart? The big day has finally come. Over the years, Zenith Academy has tested you in many ways. It will now test you one last time. Have you prepared your vows? Whoa, are we getting married? Then speak them now. You go first, Zoo. Okay. Him. So that I may use my agility to cleanse this world and protect my companions, I will enter the world as a blade dancer. I choose the curved blade as it will not hinder my speed or reflexes. Welcome, blade dancer. Come on, Valerie. I did it. Now it's your turn. Ahem. So that I may use my strength to inspire hope and eradicate evil, I will become a battle monk. I choose the staff, for it won't break, no matter how hard I strike. Welcome, Battle Monk. Today you must demonstrate mastery of everything Zenith Academy has taught you. Your final challenge awaits below. Please step aside. Oh. Before I forget, here's a little something to keep your health full. Ooh, we got tomato clubs. Now, with faith in your abilities and purpose in your actions, take the leap and return as the new recruits of our order. I'm ready, Valerie. Let's just go for it. Interesting. I like the music. What did I just do? Oh, treasure! Cool. 
I don't know what that does, but okay. This gives very uh, Legend of Zelda, like, Link to the Past vibes. Now where do I go? I don't know what to do. Oh, maybe I was supposed to jump across that way. Spanish, how are you? Oh, uh, maybe I put the ornate stone up here. I hope you're having a lovely Thursday evening. Attack! Trying to get over this nasty cold. I'm sorry, you're sick. Allergies have been bugging us. So I feel you there. Hugs. Oh, we got experience points. That's not terrifying or anything. Oh, another stone. Oh, it's more of these guys. I'm not very good at this dodging. blocking whatever I can get the hit timing but not the block timing very well huh see I'm good at turn-based combat but they also have like this block and like if you hit when if you hit a like at the right time you get extra damage if you hit it when they attack you, it like blocks or whatever. Yeah, I can't get that down. That's really hard. I can't get, I don't even know. Uh. y'all lurking and hanging out I like hanging out with you guys okay I guess we go to the elevator they haven't even been to the other side of the forbidden cavern yet how could they understand so you don't think we should at least try and explain you've seen how strong they are word will be a walk in the park Let's see them off then. Oh, 
no, it's a big scary boss guy. Exam mode engaged. Brace yourselves. Well, that was nice. They gave me a heal. Shuffle weakness. Physical. Cool. Oh, I blocked that one. Skills. Sunball. Dang. Evil robot. He's just the test administrator. <laughs> Which is about the same thing. Oh, he hit me. Moon. Oh, I've got a moonering. He slapped me. Attack, 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 attack. Can't do a combo yet. Oh no, we gotta stop him from doing the thing. Oh, did we beat him? Have you been watching Ahsoka? I've only seen the first episode. I haven't watched it yet. I've been... I kind of forgot about it, honestly. Oh, pick a bonus stat. Cool. Mana points, defense. I don't know. I kind of want more MP. You haven't heard anything good about it? I, I've heard mixed. Some people are like, yeah, and some people are like, no. Um... I think we're definitely going to go with mana points for him, too. I kind of like to wait till all the episodes are out and then watch it all at once. <laughs> Congratulations, you have been trained well. Return now to your headmaster. Thank you, robot. I'll beat you up any day. Congratulations, Valerie and Zale. You have learned everything Zenith Academy had to teach you. Ha! We did it. In record time, too. You must now learn of our ultimate power, the ability to use magic without using magic. Y'all, this phrase. <laughs> but that knowledge is for the Elder Mist to impart. Come, the villagers have gathered to celebrate your departure. I think the first episode was good. Uh... Filoni is doing it, so I have high hopes. Maybe, yeah. I remember we talking about that last time. It's on special days such as this one that the citizens of Moon Cradle are reminded of the importance of their duties. Heh <laughs> duty. Where's Garl? I don't see him. Many years ago, Valerie and Zale were delivered to us by the Great Eagle deliveries on two solstices in a row to boot. A very rare occurrence. Oh, I remember. Gran was so happy to meet to get to meet two more before she passed. Yeah. I miss Gran. All of you have come together to nurture and protect them just like your ancestors have done for so many children in the solstice before. Valerie and Zale, step forward so that the good people of Moon Cradle might gaze upon those who will soon join the ranks of the solstice warriors. This parading is ridiculous. Oh, let the villagers have their fun. It's all they get. So you're okay with this now? You know I'm not. Wow, I feel like something really bad is going to happen. Now cheer with me as we send these young heroes out across the Forbidden Cavern to meet the Elder Mist. Hooray! To the gate! What do we do? I want to see Garl before leaving. I guess we have to play along for now. Fingers crossed that we can come back after meeting this Elder Mist. Fingers and toes. My favorite show right now is the one I'm... Oh, A Discovery of Witches. Yeah, I remember you saying that. Valerie and Zale, you must undertake this journey on your own now. 
We will not fail, Headmaster. Go now through the Forbidden Cavern and atop the mountain trail to seek audience with the Elder Mist. Learn how to use magic without using magic, and you shall then enter the world as a true solstice warrior. May Luana's might protect you. May Solon's light guide you. Here, this should keep you fed for a little bit. Dang, they really like these tomato clubs. And if your adventure feels a little tough, you could take a look at these. Got Amulet of Storytelling and Sequent Flare. You just received your first two relics. Find them in the relic section of the game menu to adjust your experience. Whether you prefer a lighter challenge or are looking to push yourself to the max, relics offer a range of options. Cool. I like difficulty choices. Remember to keep an eye out for merchants. Selling any valuables you find will keep you well fed and well equipped. Now, wherever your adventures take you, you must remember your first assignment. After the Elder Mist sends you out into the world, you must secure passage to Wraith Island in time for the next eclipse. And do keep on training, for a dire cleansing awaits us. I still can't believe he wants them fighting a dweller already. That's Marine for you. We weren't much older the first time. Yeah, but... We'll find a way. Save journeys and may you cleanse this world. May you cleanse this world! The treasure! Can I go back and get it? Can't go back now. We have to meet the Elder Mist. Blah! Oh no, we're back to the beginning. Chat, hydrate. Okay, I'm gonna save. Save. Okay. Yes, hydrate. Sure feels easier now. This time we make it through. Okay. What happened to our buddy, our friend, our girl? There's treasure. How do I get it? Hey, monsters! Experience! Oh, I should have paid attention and attacked that other one first. They really like to hit him. Spike shower, oh no. Well, that wasn't as bad as I thought. Hey, we got one. I like that Nezuko dancing mode. Oh no, they killed him. jump across that or do I have to let it like go all the way down hey. I'm smart I can do puzzles
Treasure! Adventurer's vest. We should equip that. We should equip it on this dude because he keeps dying a lot. Okay, let's go this way. Oh no, more ugly slugs. <sighs> I kind of low-key want this soundtrack now. It's locked. Maybe the key's in the chest up there. It's out of reach for now. Let's look around. I... Smart, look at me go. What do y'all think of this game so far? It's cute and cozy, right? I got a mushroom soup. Mending light, cool. Dang, there's lots of treasure. Yeah, it's old. It definitely has that old school feel to it. I really am enjoying it so far. It's simple yet enough. Yeah, I really, really, really like treasure. <laughs> what does that do? Normal tax heal for 15%. Ooh, that's nice. Um, I don't know why, but I still really want to give it to him right now just because they keep attacking him. Also, I was going to look at relics. Max HP plus 100% and auto heal after combat. Oh, that's nice. Successfully timing hits and blocks causes a star flare to fly out. The character for a clear as day confirmation that the input was properly timed. Recommended for- Yeah, I'm gonna turn that one on for sure. To help me master. Honestly, I'm gonna turn that one on for a little while too. Not because like I couldn't handle it, it's more, I don't know how to explain it. Like I'm more into story stuff now rather than full on like challenges. Actually, let's do, Never mind. Um... Eh, okay, I see. Not the spike showers. <laughs> nice change for all the big fighting games with non-stop action. Yeah, I get real tired of back-to-back-to-back-to-back to back to back to back super intense, like, okay, so like FF16, for example, that game wore me out because it was just back-to-back-to-back-to-back crazy we got to do better than the last fight on our craziness and I was like yeah Diablo 4 like I burned out I haven't even done anything with like season 1 or whatever I probably will not go back to D4 for a while I love how he jumps out of the way to let her get attacked. I 
I got gold. Ooh, what's that? A lettuce? Okay, we already went to the left, so we're gonna go this way. I'm gonna have to do better with blocking because apparently that's a... Oh, I forgot it heals after battle. My bad. Because apparently that's a big thing in this one. This device is broken. We can't activate the bridge. There seems to be a detour through there to the left. Worth a shot. Was nice. The campfire feels cozy. Oh, we can rest. That's cool. LB set up camp. What does that mean? Shame we didn't get to see Garl before leaving. Campfire feels cozy. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I guess we're done. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna save. Okay. Why do I feel like we're getting ready to fight a boss? I knew it. Valerie? Sounds big. Get ready. Oh, it's it's big. It's kind of ugly. Oh my god. I'm scared. I like the music though. Oh, I hope that's not poison. I missed that last one. He's shooting his juices at me. It's gross. Make it stop. Oh, I can't. I couldn't stop that attack. I already used my ability. Dang, that hurt. Acid bug bombs. But why? That's dumb. Um, I wonder if he's going to keep summoning them. I really, really like the music. to switch turns to so he couldn't do that let's do a combo um yeah we're gonna restore some hp oh that's pretty um just because i don't want them to get me do, 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 do. Okay. Um, I don't have enough, so we'll just attack. Stop shooting things at me. Um, 
All the designs are like super cute and pretty in this game. Why is he shooting at me again? He has a lot of HP. one off <laughs> oh he brought out a lot of them Doo -doo 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 -doo. Doo -doo. <laughs> okay that's not as bad as I thought Okay. Um. I keep hearing weird noises. Can we do a combo? We really need to heal. I don't know what I want to do here. Guess we'll attack him. Him, so that way it's not so bad. We're kind of getting our butts handed to us. The music is super good though. There's <laughs> nothing else. Is he dead yet? Now we can heal. Much better, much better. Let's do that. Oh, we did it! Oh, look, I got an achievement. Boss slugged. Defeat Forbidden Caverns boss. Look at us go, our first big one. The mountain shouldn't be much further now. I realized that I should have been reading. Can I go in here? Oh, I'm glad I went in here. There's lots of treasure. Adventurer's vest. Cool, now I can put one on her. Hey, we did it. Hype and chat. Because I did it. I'm proud of myself. It was actually a little harder than I thought it was going to be. where we came from. Oh, they're terrifying. Things are starting to move. I am eager to see what these two can do. Eager and impatient too. For now, we wait. Three, you know what to do. They're scary. I don't like them. Did you like my voices? <laughs> okay. Um. Oh, I can just set up camp anywhere. That's nice. That's nice because I kind of needed to save. Oh, 
Okay. All right, where should we go? Should we go like up to the fish or should we go over to the like the cave? Fishy, fishy. Sunglow Lake. Wonder what's the other side. Let's just go here for now. We're closer and I don't want to backtrack. Hey there, were you looking for anything in particular? Buy! We can buy! Ooh. Hey look, we have 69 gold. <laughs> nice. Oh, I wonder if we uh, unlock cooking in the future. <laughs> Y'all are funny. We can fish? I want to fish. Oh, we can steer? <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing. Haha, <laughs> I got a fish. Look at me go. I got a lunar trout. I can fillet it or release it. We're filleting that. Oh, I didn't mean to. Oh, come here. What are you? Y'all, this fishing game might just uh, keep me really busy. It's a jellyfish. It's a man of war. Fish and chips. What do we got? Oh, he just like hopped right on that line. <laughs> this is fun. I like this. Come here, fish. I wish you could, like, look out there without, like... There is probably a fishing sim. Okay, so it's blinking red. I don't... I don't know what to do. Oh no, it broke! Stupid fish. Okay, I've had enough fishing. Is there stuff over here? Can I go somewhere else to fish? Flippin' fish. Bass. Oh yeah, bass masters. I remember that thing. My grandpa had like one of those handheld ones or whatever. I wonder if there's random battles on the map. Okay, so this is Solstice Shrine. Mountain Trail. Let's go to Solstice Shrine. It might have been a TV show. I don't remember. Save early, save often. It's locked. Well, why is it locked? Okay. I didn't want to go in anyway. Okay, I guess we'll go up the mountain trail. Dun 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 dun! Mountain trail. Okay, this is where we started the game. So far, so good. Elder Mist is here. This is basically where we started, so. We circled back around. We still don't know where Garl is. Garl! What if we're sent out into the world right away? Yeah, I don't know. I just wish Garl was here. We could certainly use some celestial willow jam to go with this awful bread. Haha, <laughs> the dream. Huh? Celestial willow jam? It's flipping Garl! I've got some right here, guys. I even picked some mushrooms. You won't believe this soup I'll make. 
<laughs> oh, and I found some herbs in the Forbidden Cavern. They'll do just right. Garo? What, you didn't really think I was going to let you go on an adventure without me, did you? <laughs> Garo! Aww. It's so good to see you two again. You look so strong now. Hey, why didn't you show up for our departure? Are you kidding? There was absolutely no, there was absolutely no announcement. As soon as I heard everyone gather, I went to our hideout to pack my stuff, but you left so fast. Guys, I'm so pumped for this journey. I know all about survival now. Fishing and gathering and cooking and... What's wrong? You can't actually come with us. We just wanted to say goodbye. We're on duty now and it's pretty dangerous. You can't mean that. We've always talked about how we'd leave together after your training. Plus, I spent all those years practicing in our little cave. I'm ready. Look, I may not have any special powers like you do, but I'm built strong and I've been preparing. This here is my shield. I'll be a defensive fighter. Yes. No, a warrior cook. Yes. Oh, yeah? Sure I am, and I've been reading a lot, too. See, most of the monsters you're going to face won't even be flesh mans or minions, which means anyone can fight them. Are you sure about that? Totally. You haven't seen any yet, have you? No, but... I'll know when to step aside, don't worry. Plus, you can't really travel the world with just a few sandwiches. What were you thinking? That's... Yeah. Dude has a point. See, you need me. You just do your solstice warrior duties and I'll keep your bellies full. Garl. Deal. Okay, deal. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> no way, this is awesome. I'm just glad the friend isn't dead because I was like a half expecting him to be dead. Alright, I'll start the kettle. We have so much catching up to do. Gar the royal cook joins the party. Yay, we can cook now. And so apparently after we meet this elder miss, we're able to use magic without using magic and be sent out into the world. That's all we've been told. I guess finding our own way is the final step of training. Our first assignment is to go to Wraith Island in time for the next eclipse. Wow, that's a lot. Your powers sound so cool, though. Can't wait to see them in action. So how about you, Garo? Well, it was pretty uneventful, to be honest. All I did was train and learn the skills I thought would come in handy. Every single day I was hoping to see you come out. I'm sure glad no one told me it would take ten years. Yeah, we missed you too. It's not fair that we were together and you had to do this on your own. Well, we're all together now, so it doesn't matter anymore. And I can't wait to explore the world. I want to taste everything. Hey, this soup is unreal, by the way. Right? Uh-huh. So how much food did you pack? Just enough for a few meals. It's better to travel light. And there's ingredients everywhere if you know to look. And who knows what we'll find. It's all part of the adventure. Why don't you try now, Valerie? See that bush right there? It's full of juicy berries. All you have to do is pick them. Yay, I get to pick the berries. I've been wanting to pick those for, like, ever. Cool. Perfect. Now we'll make some jam with the berries you picked. Just interact with the campfire and get ready to cook. Cook. Ooh. Y'all, I love this game. It's so cute. See, you're a natural. We can eat that jam later when we need to. Heal up. Thanks for the tips, girl. That's going to come in handy for sure. Don't mention it. Hey, I'm ready for some sleep. Ads are going to start in like 45 seconds. Oh. Girl, I'm really glad you're here. <laughs> I was just about to say that. Also, I just had deja vu. Like, I've lived this moment before. Anybody else do that? Because, like, sometimes it's freaky. Me too, guys. I wouldn't want to be anywhere else. Well, good night, then. Oh. Okay. I'll let it sit there for a second while ads play. Stupid ads. Do, 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 do. How has y'all's week been? Your th yeah, ads. I think most of you in here are subbed right now, so. Um. But I appreciate you guys being here tonight. 
I always worry that nobody's gonna show up and I won't have anybody to talk to and that's like if I have somebody to talk to I do really well streaming but if I don't I feel like my streams are like blah and so I really really appreciate you guys being here I love it just knowing that you guys are lurking so also if you can't be here that's totally okay too I didn't mean it to sound like that um, because we all have lives also it's like 11 o'clock for me so I know some people it's got to be much later like so um, yeah I appreciate you guys a lot oh no not the ads um I think I'll play a little bit longer maybe like 30 more minutes because I really kind of want to see where this goes because I'm having fun playing this game so we'll hang out for a little while longer and then we'll find somebody to raid. But definitely still probably a good 30 more minutes because I'm having fun with it so far. It's cute. The music's good. It's on Game Pass. Um, I have some two week free trials for Game Pass. If you guys want them, just DM me, let me know. Um, here's my discord. You guys can join my discord. Um, I think a lot of you are in there already. Let me know if that link doesn't work because I don't know how discord works half the time. I paid a friend to uh, set it up for me because I was like, I don't know how to do this. <laughs> Let's see. I think most of you already heard, but I'll announce it again while we're hanging out. Um, September is this month, all the discounts, the last five days of the month, uh, gift subs are discounted. But all, um, half of my revenue that I make in September will go towards a mental health charity. I'm still deciding which one I want to do. And then I'm also doing a thousand squats for St. Jude. I'm fundraising that one, but like I said earlier, it's on Facebook. so. I can't share the link because um, it'll like dox my information basically um, so unfortunately that one I'm not doing donations but I'll keep you guys updated on my squats so there's quite a few things going on in September <sighs> one minute left on ads and we'll continue the game it's been a long time since I've had fun with the game and really enjoyed getting into it like I've had fun playing games but then there's some that just feel special and Sea of Stars is pretty good so far I recommend it Also, I apologize for ads. We all know all the things about the ads. Um. Six seconds and then we can go back to the game. Okay, welcome back from the ads. If you had the ads, I apologize. Okay, good morning. Oh, I gotta click on the game, my bad. You all ready to go? I'm excited to see what the Elder Mist looks like. Should be straight up, let's keep hiking. I wonder if I need to equip some stuff. Do I, I don't think I have any extra stuff for him. I love that he has a cauldron lid, that's cute. Oh, look, a save point. Okay. Attack. Do, do, do. Oh, 
Oh no, he's gonna get hit. No! Wow, he is tanky boy. He's got 105 HP. He's a tanky boy. Oh look, treasure! I think I have to go this way. I like treasure. Abacus. Uh, displays non-boss enemies HP in combat. That's nice. Loot. Look, ingredients. I got potatoes and wheat. What's down here? Oh, I think this is where I came from when I started. Do, 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 do. Oh, look, it's the scary goats. Hi, Sebus. How are you? Oh no. Oops. Holy, that hurt a lot. Ooh, I blocked it that time. Nice. I think I'm getting the hang of it. What are his skills? Pearl and Nourish. Okay, we'll wait on that. Your towel just showered? Maybe you should put some clothes on. First gonna attack. Stuff. Yeah, I like the music too, Merlin. <laughs> Oh, how do I get to the treasure? Basic armor. Can he not wear that? Okay, can he wear that? Okay. Let's go find this elder mist. Can I go up? It looks like there's something up there. Ingredients! Oh, bell peppers. Oh, there's nothing up there. This game kind of gives me like Octopath Traveler vibes. What are those? Are those goblins? Goblinos. Oh, that's terrifying. Right, so don't step on the, the thingies. Experience! No, I didn't mean to do it on him. It's really fun. It's called Sea of Stars, and I, I'm enjoying it. What do you want? You can use the Spotify. Good night, baby. I love you. You can use Spotify. I'm not using it. Yeah, it reminds me of Octopath Traveler for sure.
Minnie's having trouble sleeping tonight. First. I need to think of more channel point stuff for you guys to do. I wish I could put more channel point sounds on there. All oh, stuff. I say we already have that. No, I guess I don't really need anything. Oh no, disgusting. Disgusting. Y'all are silly. <laughs> uh, we could try cooking a roast sandwich it always gets me you're funny them rest, refill their stuff. Okay. Here we go. We're gonna be taught how to use magic without using magic. Drop loot, a lettuce, and a bone. Wait, I want to go back up. I see stuff. Loot, experience, same thing. Yay, we did it. Okay, to find the treasure. Oh, did we level up? We leveled up. Yay! Let's see. Physical attack, hit points, defense. Attack. I might do physical defense. Magic defense is kind of low. I might actually put it there. Oh, his defense is really low, too. Um, let's do magic defense. Physical. Just because he's tanky, I think I'm going to do that. Okay, 
Now we go get treasure. Shiny pearl. I don't know what those do. I bet we can sell them. Money. There's a treasure chest down there. How do I get it? Oh, I just jump and do it. Recipe. Interesting. Look, it's a goat that sounds like a sick turkey. I don't play Honkai. I don't even really play Genshin anymore. I couldn't get into Honkai. I tried, but I just, I don't know, I didn't like Honkai Star Rail. Unfortunately. Some months Honkai will wait, same as Genshin. Yeah. Oh, I should I forgot to do the thingy. Yeah, and the storage, yeah. Genshin's huge. Actually, so is Baldur's Gate 3 and Starfield. I downloaded Starfield, but I can't play it till next week. And I'm not spending a hundred dollars to play it early when it's on Game Pass. No way. Yeah. I'm ready for some new Nintendo games. I'm ready for Detective Pikachu. That one seems pretty fun. Yep, Pokemon, Pokemon. Wait, does this just lead down where I came from? Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, I started Scarlet, uh, but I didn't really finish it. I didn't like it as much. I did like Arceus quite a bit, though. Sword and Shield was pretty good too. Yeah, hopefully Detective Pikachu is pretty good. Do 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 do. Oh, what she got? 
That was scary. Oh, I wonder if I should check out this cave first and then go up. What could this be? Yeah, I'm wondering if it's going to be more like a Professor Layton game rather than like a Pokemon game. I don't know. Okay, now I guess we'll go up. Oh, yeah, Phoenix Ride, is that? Yeah, well, I can't remember all the names. Do -do -do, do -do -do -do. Oh, ho, ho, ho! Two children of the Solstice have come for the rite of passage, but I also sense one who does not belong here. Is he brave or foolish? Let's find out. <laughs> Welcome, young adventurers, to this sacred pond. Nice to meet you, Elder Mist. My name is Garl. My, what a gregarious one you are. Enthusiasm is certainly welcome in this place of meditation, but its rites are not meant for the common folk. Children of the Solstice, step forward. Ho. Ho, ho, ho. It seems you show great potential indeed. Have you weaved your will into celestial fabrics? We have, Elder Mist. Then come closer and let them be imbued by the sacred pond's magic. Tremendous resonance. Wear them with purpose, for they will augment your innate magic. You shall henceforth have light in the darkest places and protection against the minions of the Fleshmancer. I don't feel any different. Yeah, me neither. Rest assured, the ability to use magic without using magic has taken root in you indeed. What the hell does that even mean, y'all? What does that even what does that even mean? <laughs> And how does it work? It arises from need. In the many battles that await you, victory will often demand the use of more offensive magic than one can sustain through spells alone. That is why attunement to live mana is paramount. Live mana? Oh, it allows your attacks to draw from the magic bestowed upon you at birth. And judging by the resonance you create, this power should even extend to your traveling companions. What? You are ready. Live mana will start manifesting for you the next time you enter battle. Are you ready for your final test? Elder Mist, I'd like to go with them. The Elder Mist trials have never been undertaken by anyone but aspiring solstice warriors. But I want to go with them, please. Interesting, you are the first of the common folk to ever make such a request. He sure is a peculiar one. No doubt limited when it comes to combat, but the warmth of his heart. Could he bring it back? Perhaps we should try to find out. I will allow it. Alright, thanks, Elder Mist. Consider it a test of your ability to act as a companion to the Solstice Warriors. I won't fail. We are ready. Then close your eyes and take a deep breath. Deep breath. Welcome to the Elder Mist Trials. <laughs> to pass this final test, you must bring three relics together by completing their associated challenges. The monsters that will try to stop you are immune to physical attacks, and the use of, of offensive spells is prohibited. What? How then? That is why you must use magic without using magic. My dude, stop speaking in wriggles. Live mana can boost your battle actions with a portion of your magic attack. Embrace this power and your training will be complete. I have to try that. Trials await. Should you wish to return for a while, simply close your eyes and concentrate next to where you just appeared. Godspeed. Well, here we go. Is 
that attack did nothing. A spell would probably do it, but we can't use them here. Guess that's the part where using magic without using magic comes in. But how? Hey, some little orbs appeared when I attacked. Maybe that's live mana? Could be. I feel kind of pulled towards them. Yeah, I feel it too. Let me try something. Right trigger. Oh, whoa. It worked. How does it feel? Like power. So if I attack, it should do magic damage now. Oh, I see. That was amazing. I want to try it next. Boosting has been unlocked. Regular attacks will generate live mana. Hold RT and press A to absorb and charge a boost. Up to three boosting charges can be stacked. That's cool. The magic damage type is also added on top of their weapons. When you're dealing with an intricate lock pattern, you need to make your next healing spell really count or just want to do more damage. Remember to boost. Boostio, oh! Okay, we're gonna save. And I am gonna find somebody to raid, maybe. Um, I don't know how to get out of the game. Quit. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Let me see who is on. Let's see. Um, I don't know who to raid. Hmm. I really enjoyed um, Sea of Stars so far, though. We'll definitely pick it back up on Monday. And I won't cheat and play off stream. Um, would you guys like to raid Tea with Mandy? Raid? We could do Tea with Mandy or Kitty Mama. Yeah, either one. I don't know that I've ever raided Kitty Mama. Kitty. Kitty Mama. Ugh. Let's do Kitty Mama. I've never rated her before. Thank you guys so much for hanging out tonight. I super appreciate it. Um, I will try to see you guys on Monday unless I just feel awful. And please give Kitty Mama some love for me. Hold on. I'm going to open the window so that I'm there when we hop in. That way I can say hi. Oh. Oh, ads. Um, la, 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 la. Okay, we're reading now. Bye, guys. Thanks for everything. I appreciate you. Love you. Have a good weekend.